Topping our health chaos today, a statement released today by the American Heart Association is highlighting a link between heavy metals in our environment and cardiovascular disease. Dr. Gervasio Lamas, who is the chair of the statement writing group, says chronic exposure to things like lead, cadmium, and arsenic in the air, water, and our soil will lead to increased risk of heart attacks and strokes. We need to work with our uh, politicians and with the government to make sure that we have pure water and pure food and it is not contaminated by known uh, toxins that will poison your arteries. Dr. Lamas also says that patients need to ask their doctors about their own metal levels, numbers just as important, he says, as cholesterol and blood pressure. And a new lawsuit is challenging the federal government's plan to negotiate Medicare drug prices. The U.S. Chamber of Commerce is suing the Department of Health and Human Services over this one. The group says the government's pricing program violates drug makers' due process rights by dictating prices and then punishing drug companies if they don't accept them. Drug company Merck did file a similar lawsuit, you may remember, just last week. And U.S. health advisors are backing new Alzheimer's drug, the panel recommending full FDA approval for a new medication called Lakembi. Early results show the drug can slow Alzheimer's progression by at least several months. The FDA is reviewing more extensive data, though, before deciding if the drug will receive a full endorsement. They're scheduled to issue a final decision next month.